What's up guys? Brickbeard here on The Brick Show. And yeah, it's been a while since I've done a video, but I just wanted to do this one because this box is cool and I wanted to open it with you guys. I got it at Barnes & Nobles, I believe. Actually, I'm, yes. It is the only place that you can get it. This is a Funko box, not Lego, Funko box. And I thought it would just be fun to open it up. Haven't done a video in quite a bit. Hope to do more, we'll see. This is a Lord of the Rings mystery box. And there is some exclusive Funko Pop in here. Says there's two, and I'm hoping, and there's also a mystery mini, I'm hoping that they're exclusive like to this box, and maybe even that like different boxes have different characters. Uh, like different Lord of the Rings, like, you know, they, they had a big pile of these. Are they all exactly the same, or are there is, is there some variation with exclusive ones in them? I don't know, because I only got one, but we'll see what's in here. But there is some exclusive Lord of the Rings pop. There's like a Gollum that is exclusive. I'm hoping he's not in here. Like, I could have got him off the shelf, but instead I paid 30, I think it was $30 for this box, and I'm hoping that like the ones that they sell individually are not also in this box. So let's get the, the wrap off of here and see how it's packaged. Ooh, I like this. So you open that up and boom, you got your mystery mini right there. One ring to rule them all and that pops right out. And you can see there's like a, some uh, packaging, nice packaging like that. But let's open this guy first. Now, who do I want? Now look, this does say exclusive, so like, these two are exclusive to Barnes and Nobles, which is fun. So obviously I want those. We have, what is that, Gimli in like a gold? I think that's Gimli. And then this looks like Frodo, because he has this sting. It's not super rare, but it's kind of rare because you can only get a Barnes and Noble. Actually, would rather have Sauron right there. He is the rarest, and the Ring Wraith. Either one of those. Ooh, the, ooh. Then we have Elrond here. You know what? Let's just open this up. And we will know then who we actually get. And it's going to be get the black bag, so you can't cheat. Ooh, so we got the clear Frodo. That's cool. A little red mark on the back, that's weird. So there's a look at him. If you can see that, there he is. And now back to our, our box. We're gonna remove the packaging, or actually it just kind of folds out. And then there is two pop in there. I see a Gollum, and so that's a little disappointing, but maybe it'll be different. Let's see if we can get it out of here without creasing it too much. So I got these open and this is a little bit disappointing. So this is the Gollum that I already have and they just put them in that box and acted like it was gonna be something new and it's not. You can actually go to the store right now and get this guy. So that's kind of dumb. This has been around a while and not really what I would call exclusive. Now this one I have not seen before. Maybe it's in stores separately, but I haven't seen it. So, but this one actually I love. I kind of wish they were both like this where I haven't seen it before and it shows up in the box and it's very cool. So this Galadriel is very cool. Um, I believe this is supposed to be that part where she's like freaking Frodo out uh, with, you know, she's like glowing in the forest there and uh, kind of struggling against wanting the ring. So this one I like, this one I don't like, but overall the box, $31.99, eh, you know, it's okay. I like what I got as far as these two. I already had that, and so I would just say, put some exclusives in there. Put some exclusives in there. And there actually is a game, there's, Funko's doing this a few places, there's a GameStop one, which we'll do another video where we unbox that, see if it's any better. But that's this one. That's the Barnes & Noble Lord of the Rings one. Thoughts below. Give it a little comment. And uh, hey, there you go. Thanks for watching. I've been your host, Brickbeard. And you've been watching The Brick Show.